The other thing I did with the radiator, which is kind of unique, is that on these uh, 289 models right here, uh, a lot of them, if you look on the stock, you got the uh, this radiator hose that I have over here on the left side of the engine. It's normally over here on the right side. And then right down there at the bottom is the lower radiator hose. So what happens is the coolant comes from the engine out from the, uh, let me show you guys, comes right out through this thermostat housing right here. And it travels through the hose and it used to come in on this side of the engine. And what would happen is that since the lower radiator hose is down there is also on this side of the engine is that you would just get straight downflow of the coolant coming through the radiator. Um, and it didn't spend very much time in the radiator getting cooled down. So I had our welding department uh, take the connector that was over here on this side and I had them take it off, cover the hole and move the connector to the other side. So now I'm running from my thermostat through my upper radiator hose to that side and for it to get to the water pump and back into the engine, it has to go across the entire radiator. So that is a big way to make cooling more efficient on these.